right, guys. I am Sarah Kaisak with McGuffin here at South by Southwest, and we are here with Jason Ritter, Hello. who did We'll Never Have Paris. Um, it's actually premiering today. Yay! Yay! <laughs> um, can you give us a little uh, background on your character? Uh, I play Melanie's characters, Devin's. Um, I play her brother. Okay. And uh, the movie is about um, Simon Helberg uh, plays Quinn, and uh, uh, he basically leaves her. He's been d- dating her for a while, even thinking about marrying her, and he leaves her to sort of explore this thing with Kelsey, Maggie Grace's character. And I am Kurt, Devin's brother, who is not too happy with uh, <laughs> <laughs> the situation. So did you actually go to Paris, or were you... Uh... I did go to Paris. Okay, good. But just for fun. I okay. wasn't actually there, but Simon is one of my best friends. So I was like, all right, let's just go. When do you have an excuse? You, yeah. yeah. I was going to say, you almost got chipped out of it. <laughs> exactly. Um, well, I mean, talk a little bit more about your character and kind of the interactions with the other characters. and. Uh... Um, you know, the, I mean, the, the interesting thing is that it's based on a true story, so that so unfortunately, unfortunately, so. Yeah, exactly, <laughs> unfortunately, based on a true story. So, um, a lot of the people were based on sort of real people or or a combination of different people. Um, and my character, even though he's much different in the film than uh, in real life, is uh, loosely based on Jocelyn's brother Nick, who's one of my really good friends. Um, so, uh, and and I remember we all remember this period of time uh, where this all sort of went down. And um, and I also have a sister. I could imagine easily yeah. what it would be like if uh, you know. But the the complicated thing, and also sort of the beautiful thing about the story, uh, the script, in the movie, and in real life, is that you know. Everyone really loved each other, you know, and and uh, Kurt and Quinn had been really close friends before, and so it's this awkward thing where you know we're friends, but yeah, we're but on you were brother, also a dick. sister first. <laughs> yeah, exactly. And so it's like, I love you. You must be going through a complicated time. I've been going through. I've gone through complicated times myself. Yeah. But this is my sister, and so I can't really help you through this. Yeah. Um, I can't hear you talk about your doubts about being with my sister. It's not yeah. just some person. It's someone I love. Complicated. Yes, yeah, complicated. So you also have another film here, Wild Canaries. Yeah. So you're doing double duty yes, here. Yes, exactly. Um, how has that film been received so far? Good so far, yeah. It's been really fun. We had two screenings and uh, so far. Uh, there's a couple more later in the week. But uh, it's a lot of fun. It's sort of, I think it's, you know, I mean, when I read the script, I felt like it was different than a lot of other mm-hmm. independent movies that were out there and uh, I think I just pronounced it independent which is not necessarily <laughs> how you pronounce it I decided not to abbreviate it yeah, last <laughs> second. Um, so it was a lot of fun you know I had this whole mysterious thriller element uh, yeah. and uh, so yeah I, I really enjoyed doing that movie and it was nice to finally it's really nice because both of these films I hadn't seen before so you come to a festival well, and there's a whole audience and, crowd and, yeah, yeah. and it's terrifying and exciting and exhilarating and uh, yeah and it's nice when it goes well yes yeah well thank you Jason so much for sitting down with us. absolutely <laughs> thanks for sitting down with me